Hello everyone, and today I am going to tell you a very important concept. Union of two subgroup is not necessarily a subgroup. But uh, I have also proved that intersection of two subgroup is a subgroup. That means if H and K are two subgroup of the group G, then H intersection K is a subgroup. Already I have proved it. But today I am going to tell you union of two subgroup may or may not be a subgroup. Not necessarily means may or may not. So in this case you have to give an example. H and K are two subgroups of G such that H union K is not a subgroup. Not necessarily means may or may not. That means you have to give an example such that H union K is not a subgroup. Okay. So prove that. Union of two subgroups is not necessarily a subgroup. Okay, so let us prove it. Let GK group group of integers group of integers under addition G is a group of integers under, under addition that means that means G is equal to J plus that means G is a group of integers and the binary operation is addition. So let H1 is equal to a directly I am writing Hj subgroup of G. Containing the even integers that means H is a subgroup of G containing the even integers that is H1 is equal to minus 4, minus 2, 0, 2, 4, and so on. And the binary represents is addition because H is a subgroup of G. So in G, the binary represents is addition, so H1 also, it is a subgroup under addition. Okay, so it is not necessary to write uh, that H1 is a subgroup of G uh, containing the infinity under addition. So, again, let H2 is a subgroup of G containing The multiples of 3 clear so that means x2 is equal to minus 6 minus 3 0 3 6 9 and so on so now see here very interesting I have to prove to prove x1 Union H2 is not a subgroup. We have to prove it is not a subgroup. Clear. So now, what is H1 union H2? See here. Minus 6, minus 4, minus 3, minus 2, 0. Then now uh, 2, 3, 4, 6, and so on. Clear. Now, very simple. Now, 2 belongs to H1 union H2, 3 belongs to H1 union H2. Now, 2, 3 belongs to H1 union H2. But, 2 plus 3 under addition is equal to 5 does not belong to H1 union H2. That means the closure axiom is not satisfied. Is that clear? That is, closure axiom is not satisfied therefore
therefore, H1 union H2 is not a subgroup. Because subgroup of G. See here, I have told you for subgroup, closure XM and inverse XM must satisfy. But here, closure XM fails. So, union of two subgroup is not necessarily a subgroup. Clear? If there is any doubt, then uh, please tell me in the comment box. Okay, thank you.